The most useful tool that any content creator could ever have is a complete lack of shame and humility. After that, it is probably this new kit that I'm using right now. So I have uh, the, the newest iPhone, the Pro Max one, and this iPhone is such a game changer. The camera on it is so good, it blows my mind. I'm shooting on my, my, on my Sony A7C right now, but like in uh, uncontrolled environments, nothing beats the iPhone. I could really kind of do everything that I need to do with just an iPhone, but audio quality is kind of an issue. So we were just at Sweetwater Gear Fest and my man Yuri from Sure hooked up one of these kits and he actually recorded me and Drea doing uh, an acoustic performance of one of our songs which we're gonna throw on here at the end of this video. And I was just blown away by the sound quality. So basically what it is, it comes with this whole kit where it has a Sure Manfrotto tripod. Uh, it has a holder for your phone and then a hot shoe mount where the MV88 microphone sits. You have headphone outs and it's just powered by the phone. It comes with both an iPhone cable and an Android cable. And it also comes with this carrying case so you can kind of fit everything, which is pretty cool. So I just kind of wanted to go through the spaces, show you a little bit about the app, why it's so cool. It's a stereo microphone, but you can actually change how the microphone picks things up in the app. So that's what's really kind of like amazing to it. You, this microphone is essentially app controlled with the pickup patterns and stuff like that. So the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to shoot my Patreon video for this week. Somebody actually requested that I teach one of my original songs, Reminder. So I'm gonna do that for my maiden voyage using this and just kind of see how it sounds. All right, so filming this video, here we go. Basically, this is the entire shot. I just got the couch, two lights, and then I'm running two iPhones, one with the MV88, and then just the other one, which I'm just gonna use the other iPhone for video. The reason I'm using two iPhones is because of time code. Always a pain, but uh, let's see what it sounds like. All right, so I'm actually using this and I'm monitoring myself through the Sure video app. The reason you probably wanna do it through the video app is because you can actually see uh, the actual levels of what the mic is at. So in case you, know, you need to turn your gain down, if it's gonna get too loud or whatever, it's great. Plus it also gives you different options on how you wanna save the audio and stuff like that. So the bundled apps are really, really, probably, I, I would say they're essential if you're, especially if you're working with other cameras and uh, like this one, this is a two video shot. So I'm gonna have to sync them together. So I wanna make sure the videos are right. Uh, every time I go into settings and switch something on my phone, I always forget that I did that. And then I end up at a different frame rate and it's just a headache. Anyways, gonna teach this lesson. Uh, a minor, A minor seven, A minor 11. Right, it's like the it's like the Vince McMahon riff, right? Triad, seventh chord, eleventh chord. Know what I'm saying? All right, so I did want to show how this works. I'm screen recording the actual app that you see. So the nice thing about that app, the video app, is you can see the uh, the levels right there, and I can change stuff. Uh, I can change how all this all this works. Uh, I can change like the different audio formats that I'm like shooting in. Forty four one, forty eight. You can go back to actually like the type of, you can go from 4K to whatever. Uh, I don't know if we're actually hearing the audio on the screen recording of this because I think Apple has it where it disables the microphone. So I actually just have like a separate iPhone mic just picking up what you're actually hearing right now. I just kind of wanted to show you a, a little bit of the actual interface for this. I think the, the iPhone, Mic is disabled when you're doing a screen recording on an iPhone, probably for blackmail purposes, right? <laughs> Not totally sure about that, but I think that's probably it. Anyways, uh, that's a really cool feature. And again, if you go to the regular settings here, this is re this is really impressive. This is probably the most impressive part of the whole thing, right? So you can kind of see my levels right there for the sure. This right here, it lets you actually change how the microphone pickup pattern is being used which is kind of like insane, right? You can do this figure eight thing. So if you're giving like an interview, you can have like each side of it, but there's a lot of functionality for this. That just kind of blows my mind. That worked out great. Now I wanna show you just how you can actually use it to record music. Uh, we've done acoustic performances just using the iPhone microphone on here, but the quality that our guy Yuri got was really kind of like next level. It sounds just like I was just in my studio just kind of setting stuff up. Keep in mind, this is on like a showroom floor too, which, you know, there's like noise and stuff like that. It's not really like a like a legit studio environment from a from a sound engineering standpoint. And uh, I think it's just re it's really cool. So 
let's feel free to listen to this. Uh, let me know what you think. I'll have affiliate links to Sweetwater to get one of these for yourself. And if you have any questions, let me know. Stuck in a corner, babe Holding cold